Well, these relics actually date to the famous 1836 siege of the Alamo by Santan and his troops. Uh, we have a collection here of ranging from pistol balls, these are lead, lead balls, through a collection of lead musket balls, shot balls, probably cannon fill. Some of the lead balls, incidentally, are, have been impacted, uh, whether they, they were certainly shot in anger and uh, whether they impact against the wall or humans is something I couldn't determine here. Uh, we do have also fragments of cannonballs a very, in which, um, which were fired during the, Alamo. during the Alamo siege, mortar uh, fragments which were fired by Santana during the siege period. These are fragments which, uh, of balls which had exploded in front of the Alamo church during the famous siege. I would term the excavation unusually successful uh, because of the preservation of the materials which were recovered. During the recent, these, our recent excavations at the Alamo, we were fortunate to go into an area which had been protected by a paved sidewalk which had been built around 1889. It's a flagstone paved sidewalk and all materials earlier than the 1889 construction period, including the siege period, the, the earlier Spanish period, the mission periods were all nicely preserved below the, the paving. Uh, this is really something much more than we had expected. We, we expected to recover certain amounts of artifacts, but, there, but uh, we had actually come up with a sequence of artifacts which date from the mission period through the Spanish period, through the Mexican period, the siege period, the Anglo period, and into modern times.